Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Boss Talk. Yeah, everybody on it. Boss Talk. Mm-hmm. It's a unique hustle. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique okay. hustle. It's your boy ECO. And I'm on the most about the way, and we creating content every damn day. Hey, man, it's going down, man. We over here at Boss Talk 101 once again, man. And guess what, man? We got some special guests in here today, man. They really don't need no introduction, man. I, I, uh, Man, I've been trying to get both of these guys on the same panel, man. It's going down, man. I finally was able to make it happen, man. We got my boy Melvin Farmer, and we got my boy OG Percy OG in the Percy. building. Shout out to Supreme and uh, Mayhem and all the people that uh, are sitting around this August panel. You know, because like, like I say, uh, and, I, and I asked this question with a, gr- a different group of people, but California, I had California, Texas in here. And I always be asked, thinking in my mind, like, to be, and, and Melvin, you know from, from long time ago, the the with, with being the crib from being in California, and then someone being uh, affiliated with crib in Texas. How does I mean? Does that even does that merit the respect, or do they even do they? Cause my cousins from LA, and when they would come down, it wasn't really a thing to where they was like they come down. I take them to Shreveport. They act like, hey man, you know they solidified and. What we doing, what and whatever. So, how do you look at that? Well, uh, before we had expanded, when it was just uh, East Side and West Side Compton, before they had even left, let alone uh, the city from the zip codes, uh, it went through expansion. Particularly when the drug came out, the drug game, game came out about '77, and they started floating. But I've always looked at it like this: uh, uh, we don't die, we multiply. Okay, and, and OG Percy being when you see somebody that from the California area, do you how do you look at them as far as the representation of what you guys represent in Texas? Let me see, let me see. <laughs> they all right with me. <laughs> I, I'm saying that to say I've never looked at a crib from California. Okay. Yeah, that part. So you never met? Nah. Never really? met, never seen one, never shook hands. But today, you got to say, yeah. Hand. That's what with it's all one. about. The with unity. a real one. Yeah, with a yeah. real one. And so. we got Supreme here, y'all. Just yeah. want to make that announcement. What's now. happening? What's happening? What's happening, Supreme? So What's you, 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 you on this August panel now? For sure, I'm honored. It's a pleasure. Okay, so, no doubt. And, and and the thing, I don't want you to hold back on the questions that we have for these brothers because at the end of the day, there's a lot of things. And I got mayhem. I'm, I'm going to be pulling him too. Uh, it's just, I think it makes for good conversation. I think it makes for uh, education, and it also shows unification. And 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 at the same time, it shows growth that you know that we would still be here after all these years and and still be able to have lived and to talk about it because a lot of people didn't. So I, I just like the fact that you brothers came over to uh, spend time and conversate with us and make history. Yeah, this history right here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like sure. it, man. I, I got a lot of good good guys that's in here today. I'm even here to sell these books. You know what I'm saying? I'm a youth mentor, right? And my job is I'm here to really teach young men how to be young men, right? And so when it comes down to it, my overall objective is to teach a young man how to be responsible. And that is to, and that's how to, and that's that. what that means is how to be responsible, be responsible for what he's doing, but also how to maintain his character. Right. So now when I'm saying and when I say maintain character, we don't need to be making up definitions and and just putting this all, you know, you, you know, and taking the word character out of context. Right. The word character means the way other people perceive you. Right. Character is important because we have to maintain character. That's why I said I grew up around a crip, a cripping character. Right. And that was dangerous for me. But it also saved me. And, but it was also uh, somebody that was out there that was, available, uh, that was available to teach me and give me the game. Except his game was that. You know, that character was that. And that character has character flaws. But it is what it is. But in order for us to correct it, we first must acknowledge that we have these flaws. We cannot fix something that we don't have. Right? So when we sit here and we sit here and we try to play mind games and say Aramis and Nipsey Hussle, man, that's the same person. That's the same person. So, and my thing is this. So it, the most important thing, one of the most important things, I ain't say the most important thing, but one of the most important things that I, I could teach any man is respect. You know what the most important thing about respect is? Mm-hmm. Don't disrespect. Disrespect. Thank you. Um, uh, OG person. I got one. I just, yeah, I want to ask you that same okay. question. I want to ask you in a way to where 
the area that you affect, the people that you're around, because mm-hmm. he's coming from a California right. standpoint. Right. You here in it. Texas. And and what he said really it. it involves around government, period. But yeah. what what would what would you do to help influence uh the youth and uh our people from going into those situations? It's only it's it's, it's one thing I'm out the and one thing I'm out the when it comes down to the youth right now is the minds. If I can change their lives, they can the only way to change your life, you gotta change your mind. That's the only way. That's a lot Mind. of influence too, whether we want to, you know, add heed to it or not. In, entertainment is business. Feeds, it, it feeds through these microphones and it feeds through these earphones just as well as people talking. And them phones is pretty much you was talking that's about. Drug. That's pretty much where they tap into a lot of different things. You guys, um, man, like I said, you guys did a great job, man. Uh, I always enjoy sitting down at the round table with some men of you guys' stature. You know what I'm saying? August panel, as I'm calling it. But, man, Boss Talk 101 is a thing, man, and I appreciate you guys for coming on here. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.